It's a great pleasure to show the things in a large space. I mean, I had several shows before, but never had a chance to spread it in such a, let's say, football field size, which is a big challenge for me because I like to create some kind of landscape from my pieces. And for this, the best is, uh, um, we call it Jinka in Czech, and this is the, for baby, uh, baby ass. It sucks a lot of water, but you can cool the welting point. So we are surprised that also tools for handling kits can be helpful in, in, in the workshop. We are the exhibition Christoph Kintera, I am not you. Der Künstler Christoph Kinterer kommt aus Tschechien und hat bei uns seine bisher größte Einzelausstellung im Museum Tangen. Die Ausstellung ist in enger Zusammenarbeit mit dem Künstler entstanden und ist bei uns im Museum kuratiert von Andres Pardey und von mir zusammen. Und wir arbeiten jetzt in der großen Halle mit einer ganz offenen Disposition, in der er verschiedene Objekte platziert und zu einem Gesamtarrangement vereint. Es gibt Wände, die man heben und senken kann und die nutzt er, um eigentlich stets wieder neue Ausstellungssituationen zu schaffen. Das ist ein wichtiger Aspekt neben seinen eben kinetischen und material opulenten Arbeiten, dass er auch die Institution, in der er sich bewegt, stets herausfordert. Für mich ist es wichtig, nicht nur die Pieces zu präsentieren. Ich möchte eine Erfahrung machen, indem ich zum Museum komme und escape from this ordinary routine like going inside, buy the tickets and go. I would like to uh, accompany my sculptures with a method which will uh, guide you to the museum in a, let's say, extraordinary and unexpected way. Yeah, I see the start of the Almost, yeah. and now maybe we will turn it like this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah it's like joining the spaceship. Yes. In that particular piece, which is the new one, it's called the Demon of the Growth. I just wanted to work with this aspect of molecularity being created with very ordinary profane uh, balls, any kind of balls. You have a football balls, tennis balls, golf balls. It's the element we can use as a sculpting material, why not? And that's, for me, is still a great adventure. I want to speak about something growing, a never-ending growing, which is not possible in the world of economy and ecology, there's this topic of the growth, so that's why I call it the demon of the growth. I mean, the title is an uh, anchor of the piece. I'm doing sculptures because I don't want to just use language to communicate. On the other hand, all our society, you know, it's standing on the roots of language. So that's why we tend to have this language anchor like which gives the steady point for the sculptures. By the way, doing sculptures it's in a way a sport. I mean honestly I have to tell you there's a lot of physical work but uh, there is something else and that's why I do it. I want that people are thinking about the sculptures. I think sculpture can be also without electricity and without movement. But it's true that uh, I do a lot with these mechanical and electronical things. It's just an urge of doing things. And the pleasure comes from I did it with a lot of unsuccessful moments, with a lot of mistakes and so, but at the end you are there and that makes me happy.
it's a constant way of thinking. You have to just be uh, passionate with it. And uh, that's my strategy. Public space is one of the disciplines I have ready for the outside here. Public art, which is temporary, and it's called one euro public jukebox. Do you have money? It's very complex for me now because we are in the middle of making it and uh, uh, my head is full of that jukebox. It is simple, there is a hundred tracks, they are not uh, typical radio songs, they are titles, so for example if the song is called Let's Talk About Sex, uh, you will not hear this stupid uh, radio song, but you will hear uh, for example the pigs. Humor, irony, that's a powerful tool, for sure. I mean, it's this aspect of positivity in any cases. This is a part of Czech mentality, you know. I don't like to generalize things, you know. Of course, people are different all over. But one of the Czech mentalities to, that we have a sense of humor and this irony, and I like to pronounce it also to the art. Seine Kunst hat dieses Potenzial sehr stark, dass man nicht nur einfach davor steht und es schön findet, sondern es findet stets eigentlich sehr viel mehr statt. Ich finde, er ist einer der innovativsten und spannendsten jungen Künstler und die Ausstellungserfahrung, die man hier machen kann, die ist sicher einzigartig. I heard this name. <laughs> I'm, I'm afraid it's me. <laughs> But it's not you. <laughs>